Today we're going to make these no-sew bunnies out of drop cloth fabric. Let's get started. So first you're going to cut your bunny template out. Next you will fold your fabric over tracing your bunny template. Now we're going to cut our bunny out. Feel free to use pinking shears. I think this would be a super cute finish and would also prevent fraying. I personally like fraying. I think it adds to that farmhouse vibe and gives that worn look that I'm always going for. Cutting your bunny template, we're now going to glue the bunny together, starting with the ears first. Stuffing as you go. This makes it easier and I also find that it just has a cleaner look to it when you do this you could stuff at the end if you want it just make sure you leave the bottom half open I like to use a wooden spoon to push the stuffing all the way in hard to reach spots like the tip of the ears working your way all the way down continue to glue the bunny until you've reached the bottom Leaving that bottom half open, now we're going to finish stuffing the bunny. Once you've reached your desired fullness, now you're going to hot glue the end of the bunny together. Now the next steps are totally optional, but I did go ahead and add a cute little bow and use my hand stamps to add cute little Easter sayings. Now if you don't want this, or if you want this but want to use this all spring long, you could turn these bunnies around and have them for Easter and just through spring because they are the perfect farmhouse decor. If this video is too fast for you, I also did a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to make a fabric bow. Now I did pull at my ends kind of like this because I do like that frayed look. Um, you can see how that looks here. Next, I added cute little Easter sayings with my hand letter stamps and ink. You can find these at Amazon or Hobby Lobby. I use them for so many things. Now we're just going to hot glue that little bow on and just press it in. And there you have it, a DIY farmhouse no-sew bunny to use all spring long. Thanks for watching.